Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a September flip through of all of my planning spreads. I haven't really been doing like plan with me's anymore just because I get home from work and I actually fill this in daily. That just really helps me. However, I did do a plan with me on this spread. This is kind of more filled in now, but um, if you're interested in this spread and how I kind of just set my weeks up, I'll put it I think it goes there um, in, a, in a card up for you guys. But anyway, this is August 26th through the 1st of September. So this is my first week. This was kind of a fair themed week. However, I didn't end up going to the state fair. As some of you know that I've been following along on Instagram and Facebook, I post on Instagram and then it kind of just goes to Facebook. I'll put the link below if you guys want to follow me there, but I have been having some stomach issues and problems with that kind of thing. So, you know, I talked to about it with my mom because that's who I was going to go with. And she's like, you know what, let's just forego the state fair this year. Because basically you go to the state fair and you just like eat all the fried food because it's like epic and delicious. But she's like, I don't want you getting sick there and you know, all that stuff. I'm like, sounds good. And as you can see, I got sick there, which was great. <laughs> I actually stayed home that day. I mean, I, I worked from home, but I don't want to work from home. I want to go into the office, but there are some times where I cannot, unfortunately. So anyway, I got a stitch fix this week, which was awesome. I actually have a stitch fix like literally downstairs right now. And I think I'm going to film that um, tomorrow when I get home. I haven't even opened up the box yet. It was my coworker's birthday this day, or actually this day. And then um, it was also my one year anniversary at work. So we celebrated, we went to Noodles and Company. Um, so yeah, but that's kind of what happened. Oh, and then I uh, visited my grandparents and my brother came over for lunch with my mom. All that good stuff. Lots of happy mail. I got lots of happy mail from the wild collab sale, which should be up by the time this is up. So I'll leave a card for you guys if you want to check that out. And then this is the next week. So this is Typically in my area, I'm in Minnesota, so like all of our public schools, for the most part, start the day after Labor Day. So that's kind of how I grew up. <laughs> and so I did this one as kind of a school themed. So Labor Day I had off, so did a bunch of things. As you can see, I've got fun migraines and all that fun stuff in here. Um, I've also been, you guys will notice over here, I'm tracking some stuff. Um, I am tracking tums of how many I take per night. And let's just say the medicine that they're giving me currently isn't working. So I have to supplement it with tums, which also isn't working kind of, it's just a whole, it's like a literal pain in the stomach. So <laughs> yeah, had a migraine two days in a row. So I had migraine this day, which means I didn't really do much. And then another migraine here at work, which really stunk. I had a doctor's appointment. I had to contact some stuff for my vehicle, went to Walgreens. I swear I go to Walgreens like all the time now. Um, I also got my auto glass repaired. I had like a little chip in it. So um, I got that repaired. I had to schedule a surgery that I've already had. So that'll be up here in just a moment. And then planned. Let's see, did some other fun things over here. Oh, I started watching Mindhunter. By the way, I'm done with Mindhunter um, because I already watched both seasons. <laughs> I just like can't stop. It was so good. So, so fun. If you guys have any suggestions on Netflix, let me know. But Mindhunter was amazing and I loved it. Um, so yeah, I've got a bunch of happy mail over this weekend, did some filming. I set up my new planner for work. I cleaned my garage. I feel like I'm like always in flux of cleaning my garage. Does anybody else have that? I just feel like it's never clean enough or picked up enough. I don't know, whatever. And then I went out to brunch with Jody and Ryan. Uh, Jody is from Life's Organized Chaos and Ryan is from A Man With The Plans. I will leave their video uh, or their, their channel links down below. Go check them out. After that, I did a little retail therapy shopping. I went to Home Goods. I went to the Edina location, Eden Prairie and Nolwood Mall. Um, I just really needed some art. So I was looking for some wall art and I did find a bunch of things. So um, I know I've been talking about for a long time doing an updated house tour and I'm gonna do that someday I just don't know when <laughs> so anyway and then um yeah I did my meal prep at, like I usually do on Sundays and then I also made my grocery list as well 
And then we get into the 9th through the 15th. And as you can see, I can just notice right up ahead, migraines. Yeah! Um, I worked from home this day. I had chest pain. My chest pain is attributed to some results that I'll talk about in just a moment. <laughs> so I did work from home that day. Um, I did go out with some friends. We just went and grabbed some dinner, got a bunch of happy mail, went to dinner at my parents' house, hung a bunch of art, and then I cleaned the garage again. Like, I can't stop cleaning the garage, apparently. Uh, Target. I ordered my costume for Halloween. I know that's, like, way far away, <laughs> but I... I'm gonna be one of my coworkers for Halloween. So I was approving stuff with her to be like, okay, would you buy this? And she's like, heck yeah. I'm like, okay, perfect. So anyways, I'll probably end up posting a picture of it like on the 31st because we're gonna be working on the 31st and we're gonna be doing some fun things in the office that day. So I'll have somebody take a picture of me in the outfit. And then Saturday, Sunday, didn't really do too much. Um, organized some of my paperwork, which was nice to do. Purged a bunch of paperwork, which was awesome. Um, I ordered a quilt online. Um, I, th I actually just got the shipping notification today. So it did take a while. Um, there was a citywide garage sale. So like the whole neighborhood was just like a flutter with things. And then I just paid a bunch of bills. And then we get to the 16th through the 22nd. So this is where the first, I don't know, they call it a surgery, but just cause they like put you under, but it's more of like a procedure. I had an endoscopy, which basically means that they put you to sleep and they put a tube down your throat as well as a camera and see what the hell is going on. So what happened was they took a bunch of biopsies. Everything came back pretty normal or as, as they expected it to come back. But um, I also have a hiatal hernia, which that just means that there is part of my stomach that's creeping up into like places it shouldn't be and pressing on my like chest cavity wall kind of. And that's why I feel that chest pressure and that chest pain quite frequently. So um, like my stomach is going places it shouldn't go basically. So I am in the midst of getting that fixed. Um, I don't have any updates of when that's going to happen, but that is what they found out. So this was pretty whatever of a normal week, I guess. And then um, in the morning I did work from home. I didn't have to go in until noon that day. So then I just kind of wrote out on here all the things that I could do before I went in. So I could have oatmeal at 6 a.m. or by 6 a.m. Um, I had to stop all clear liquids by 10 a.m. and then at 10 a.m. they wanted me to drink 12 to 20 ounces of Gatorade and then be done with it by 10. So yeah, and then a hiatal hernia, that's what they found out. So then my mom stayed over that night and then she left about noon the next day, um, you know, cause I had to have a responsible adult with me. Um, I did work from home this day because I couldn't drive for 24 hours after being put under. Um, but uh, we did a ticket giveaway at work and it was also national pepperoni pizza day. So they had pizza over there. So I just worked from home and then I was so tired. I took a nap. Um, so yeah, and then Saturday <laughs> I took another nap cause I was so tired. Like. The next day, it wasn't too bad in the morning, but man, at like 24 hours afterwards, it's just like, pfft, like hit me, I don't know. Um, yeah, and then I had a frog came in my house. <laughs> that was exciting. It was really, really stormy and rainy that whole weekend, or like at least that morning, and a frog decided to come and seek refuge inside of my house. So I was like, oh, no, you're gonna go back outside, little friend. <laughs> so anyway, um, moved some boxes out to the garage for my brother had another migraine. Yay. I feel like this is just like Emily's medical history. Yay. <laughs> um, so yeah. And then, um, you know, did a bunch of things, edited videos and my brother came up to pick up all of his stuff and then went out to dinner with my parents and brother that evening. And then we are into this week, which today is the 29th. So this week was Meh. I mean, I don't know. There's just so much going on, which is weird because I normally have like a very simple life, but I've got a lot of medical crap going on. So Monday, I actually stayed till seven o'clock, which is why I have my nice little peanut butter taco sticker that says, fuck it. <laughs> so I was just trying to get this order out and it just took so long and it was oh, just a pain in my butt. Um, I had to stop at Walgreens because I had a medication change that I had to deal with. And then 
the next day, okay, so my brother drove to Iowa, like he actually lives in Iowa, so um, moved all of his stuff and then went to Iowa. I had to email my doctor, I got a flu shot, and had to go to Walgreens again because they did more thing. It's a whole thing. <laughs> this medication wasn't right, so then they gave me a new medication. Um, I had a migraine, unfortunately. I watched This Is Us, oh, it's so good, you guys. Um, so that was fun. And then regular work, went to a meeting with some friends, and then my mom came over and um, walked the dog, because she was just over here. And uh, let's see, oh, my friend Kristen, her birthday was on the 26th. I worked from home, actually, both of these days. I was planning on working from home this day anyways, because I had a doctor's appointment at four, and it was just a pre-op, but we needed to talk about my hernia results and all of that stuff. So they said like, hey, can we give you a call if anything opens up in the day? And I said, yeah, that's not a problem. So I was gonna plan on working from home here. Unfortunately, again, chest pain, same thing. Uh, went to the grocery store later on that night and I was watching some Netflix, more migraine, migraine, good times. Uh, Walgreens again and um, that evening I did some laundry posted my budget did some name tags for my upcoming high school reunion that's coming up which is exciting um, I did some cleaning yesterday so I cleaned my entryway closet my brother has had stuff in there for a year now so now that he's moved he's going to he went to Iowa I was able to uh, revamp that a little bit so i was able to clean it out declutter everything i actually decluttered a little bit in my closet too so i have two um like garbage bags full of stuff that i'm going to be taking a donation probably sometime this week um, i was planning on going to the grilled cheese festival in minneapolis with ryan from man with the plans however his plans changed and then earlier in the week we were texting and i'm like you know what i'm having so many issues with my stomach and digestion i just don't think that's a good thing and I can't really be drinking alcohol with like all the weird medications I'm on. So, and like the tickets, we hadn't even purchased the tickets yet, but um, the tickets came with like the booze and then like a tasting thing from the vendors. And I was like, yeah, it's probably a better idea just to cancel it. And so he's like, okay, sorry, I just didn't want to like leave you hanging. I'm like, no, I, <laughs> I think it's best for everybody. So he actually ended up going out of town, which was great. So anyway, today is Sunday. I paid a bunch of bills. I have, well, I still kind of have a migraine, but it's better now. Um, Doyle has had diarrhea all day, which has been very interesting. Thankfully, he hasn't messed in the house, but I don't know what he got into, but I made him some rice and he's on the mend. Um, but yeah, I've been trying to lay down and it's just like not working. And so I'm filming right now, but I'm gonna be doing a little bit of meal prep later on um, in maybe about an hour or so. So anyway, that is my look at September for 2019, all my spreads. I will be back next month to share October. My most commonly used sticker shops, I will leave down in the links below. I hope you guys go check some of those shops out. I absolutely love all of them. And if you have any questions about any specific sticker or setup or anything else like that, um, feel free to put those in the comments down below and I'll try to answer as many of you guys as I can. Oh, and I should answer one more question. Um, as for the hernia, I don't have any answers yet, so that'll probably be more in October that I'll have to talk about that. So uh, trying to get the surgeon and my medical regular doctor to talk and they're going to be doing that next week because we talked on Friday, so... I'll know more next week. So anyway, I am gonna jet. Thank you guys so much for hanging out today. I really appreciate it. If you liked the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you